Hey, what is up everybody? Welcome to week five, day number 24 of commercial diving school. Today, I'm gonna to be talking about our lesson we started on compressors and diesel engines. And I'm also gonna be explaining our competency books that we got today. So if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe to the channel, like if you enjoyed and leave any comments or questions down below. Now today, um, for breakfast, I didn't get to eat because I actually um, there was traffic this morning on the way to school, so um, I missed the van that takes people to school. So I actually met up with them like at the school and then said like, hey, can you do me a favor and like, you know, pick me up at the parking lot. So, you know, that was cool. They actually did. So, um, but I didn't eat breakfast, but I heard that it was, you know, eggs and waffles. So take I'll take their word for it, whoever told me that. And um, so after our muster, we jumped into our lesson on um, d compressors and diesel engines. Now, why are we learning about compressors and diesel engines? Um, because they're gonna be you know, prominent in the you know, commercial diving world. And um, you know, we're gonna be using them all the time and it's good to know a little bit about them because um, just knowing that you know oh the compressor is not working because it doesn't have fuel in it you know stuff as simple as that can really save um, time and energy and all that stuff if you know kind of know a little bit about them um, we are told that those you know compressors and diesel engines if there's something seriously wrong with them you're going to send them into a shop obviously but if it's like minor things like you know checking the coolant or checking the oil or checking the fuel or maybe changing a filter or something like that you know you should kind of know a little bit about that stuff so that's what we're working on today um, and then we're going to be tested on what we learned and I, we're diving tomorrow so I think the test is going to be probably Monday morning so um, then we rolled into lunch which was um, swish munch swish 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 swiss mushroom burger um, and curly fries uh, mac and cheese um, also baked beans and corn on the cob so a lot of good food today for lunch um, and then after lunch, we went outside and we looked at a diesel engine that they have at the school. Um, it's actually on a little trailer and wheels. Um, so you, op you can open it up and there's the um, diesel engine inside. And they use that to run pneumatic tools. So if you don't know, pneumatic is like compressed air. So kind of like the, you know, impact um, drills they use you know in auto body or mechanic shops where you hear the woo -woo, like those things um, that's ran off pneumatic air and we have tools like jack like underwater jackhammers that run off air and stuff like that so um, that's kind of what they use them for so we went outside we looked at one um, kind of uh, got shown like what are the different parts how do you start it up real easy stuff but um, you know, we always try to make sure we have something that's hands on because a lot of people learn that way. You know, a lot of people can't just be in a classroom going through PowerPoints. They don't really learn that way. So um, it's good that we actually do some hands on stuff. And then um, after we did that, we got our log um, competency books. And basically what that is, is it's a little spiral bound booklet that's about 20 to 30 pages and you kind of you get signatures basically for each module so we kind of got them late obviously like we should have gotten them like maybe one of the first days of school because every time you do something that's in that logbook you have to get it you know initialed by an instructor and then that's how they know that you know you're competent in all of these things kind of like a qualification card or something like that where you get it signed off of. Um, but um, yeah, we got it kind of late. So if you're thinking about going to school and they have something like that, um, definitely you know look into getting that early because I kind of had to go through it today and be like, okay, I already did that, 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 and just go through so much of it. 
and then get a lot of it signed off. Um, and you can run, kind of run into that situation where it's like, oh, that was a while ago. So, you know, so it, um, we got that book today um, and I got some stuff signed off. So tr to try to get us caught up since we got it late. And um, basically um, for the schedule we got coming up tomorrow, we're diving. Um, we should be doing kind of the same kind of stuff as we were doing Wednesday, just getting used to the water, walking out on the bottom of the river. Um, and then uh, the instructor said we might throw in some like drills or throw in something. So I'll definitely let you guys know what we actually do um, after the fact, after I actually do the dive. Um, and so definitely stay tuned for that see what we did for our dive. Um, but other than that, that's all I have for today. Um, if you like the video, you know, leave a like. If you have any kind of questions or any kind of comments, leave it in the comment section down below. I love reading comments um, and I'll definitely like your comment. Um, so um, I'll definitely see it, I'll respond. So definitely leave any comments and um, so yeah, subscribe and you know, Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.